What's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you how to control your CPU fan speed on your Mac computer. You can increase manually or decrease your fan settings with this free software. First, open your internet browser and then go to Google and then Google type Max Fan Control and then press enter. And then the first link is going to appear. It's going to be crystalideas.com Max Fan Control. Just open it. And then once this window is going to appear, click on free download. And then in here, we need to download for Max. So just click download for Max. And then once the download is complete, we can minimize this window. And then we need to open download folder. And in download folder, click on Max Fan Control. Then this window is going to appear. Press on open. And then once this window is going to appear, we need to press on move to applications folder. And that's it. By default, it's going to open up. If, for example, it's not going to start up by default, what we can do, just press on your screen somewhere and then press on go and then click on applications. And then in applications right here, you can see Max Fan Control. Just double click on it and then this window is going to appear. And then right here, you can see in the top corner, little fan icon appeared. And then on this window, by default, it's set to auto. You can see the minimum speed is 2700, current speed 27, or it actually goes up and down. And then maximum RPM is 8000. So then what you can do, if you, for example, if you would like to set up your custom speed, maybe it's just always running too loud, or maybe you just want to increase the speed. Maybe your laptop is just running a little hot. So what we need to do, we need to press on custom. Then this window is going to appear. So right here, we can set up just constant RPM value, or we can set up on sensor based value. And then right here, we need to drop down this and then we need to set to CPU core average. So just to set an average for all cores. And then right here, we can set the temperature. And for example, if you're not sure which temperature to set to, you can Google it, just open Google and type max CPU temperature. And it's going to tell you about average CPU temperature. And then what we'll also we can do, we can press cancel here. Then you can just hide this menu, just hide to the menu bar, and then it's just going to disappear. Then when you press on it, you can press on show max fan control. Then this window is going to appear again. Then you can press on preferences. And in here, we need to put a check mark next to auto start minimized with system and it's recommended. And then menu bar display. Then right here under sensor, what we're going to do, we're going to drop down the menu. And then in here, we're going to press on CPU core average. And once we do that, you can see in the top right temperature just appeared. So that little temperature gauge is going to be constantly here. And then you can close all this and then you're going to be able to see and monitor your CPU temperature. And this is pretty much it. If this video is helpful to you, press that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.